Well, hello everyone out there in YouTube land. This is your girl Saida, the domestic animated of distinction, coming back again as always to you live and direct. I hope all is well with everyone. Hope everyone is having a great day. I am having a great day, getting a lot accomplished, and that's always good for me to check things off of my list. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, and I'm getting ready to eat dinner. Uh, so yeah, you know, I when I did my video, my butter making video, and I hope you all liked that video, uh, and my accoutrements, um, I forgot to mention more, well, not really forgot, I just didn't have the time allotted because I don't do any editing, I didn't have the time allotted to really do much talking about my butter keeper, or you can call it a butter bale. Um, and uh, this is by Norpro, and uh, like I said before, it keeps your butter. I don't know about you, but I, you know, I love butter. But you know, who wants to wait? Have to wait for it to soften and whatnot. So you use a butter bell for that uh, purpose. And with this butter bell, again, it keeps your thing, your butter, uh, it, you know, up to thirty days soft and spreadable and it seals out any air uh, and it, this one holds a half a cup of butter and it has more information on the side it says the instructions by insulating protecting and cooling butter you know because what is what are crocs for it's basically a crock you know like uh, crock pots and things like that remember back in days when we didn't have there was no refrigeration and things like that people use crocks to keep so many things in so uh, this is where this uh, idea came from it's nothing new it's you know centuries old anyway um, is it century mm, yeah centuries should be at least anyway uh, so anyway it says cooling butter you can maintain it at a perfect spreading consistency. Water is used to provide an airtight seal protecting the flavor and freshness. For best results, the butter keeper should be stored away from direct heat or sunlight and the water replaced every three days. And I mentioned that too about the water uh, being replaced every few days. There's also, you can also use, uh, put vinegar in it to keep it um, you know fresh or whatever so but another thing and look at my cute spreader oh my goodness look at my spreader my new one and I didn't even open this one yet I need to open it uh, today because it's been some time now since I've had it but I hadn't opened it yet because I've only been using the one um, so you know I wanted to show you, and two, uh, if I were to buy another one, which I am going to because I love this one marble one that I like, and I'm going to give this one away or just keep it uh, for bigger gatherings, I would get something with a, with a bigger, more grip, uh, more handle to grip because, although, you know, this is not bad, you know, I have, it's not too bad, but just for the sake of it being child friendly and husband friendly, you know, with those, uh, you know, larger hands or with smaller hands. I don't want any fumbling. So I wanted to show you. Oh, and also, uh, as you are taking butter out, make sure you, the level of your water, your cold water, make sure it's always cold, your ice cold water comes up. So as your butter is decreasing, your water level should be going up so I meant to tell you because I don't know if I said it let me see this sits out on your table very nicely see how nice it is it's can you sits out on your table so for your dining table your breakfast table or whatever you'll have it out uh, the 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 butter part of it the 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 uh, this part of it the bell and you know so that everyone could you know, utilize it from, you know, on the table, your breakfast table uh, or whatever, whenever, you know, you're having your meals and whatnot. So then it's just sitting out here. It's very attractive. You know, it's a very attractive something uh, so that you guys can use. So that is what I wanted to show you all because I was not sure that I showed it and or given gave enough information when I um, presented it. So yeah, that is all. But if you have any questions, um, 
please don't hesitate to ask in the comments section and I'll be more than happy to answer what I can answer. So I really thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you like it. Please share it if you feel like it was wor uh, worthwhile information. And don't forget to um, uh, subscribe if you haven't so that you can become a part of this wonderful family uh, over here of uh, love and randomness. <laughs> All right. I love you so much. And thank you so much uh, for watching. Bye-bye. This is your girl, Saida, the domestic handmaiden of distinction, signing out for now. Got to get that together. <laughs> signing out for now. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.